Welcome back to my channel. Uh, today's repairs, or what I'm doing today, is a 47 inch Vizio TV. Don't believe the sticker LG display, but it is a Vizio. It is a 47 inch. Come on. There you go. There's the sticker. All right. All right. Get a backlight out on this. A uh, person who dropped it off for me to have says uh, you can hear the audio. Everything seems to work other than just no picture. So I figured a bad power board and or backlights. But zooming in closer here, I got these little capacitors here. Well, that, that one's cracked. Totally discolored. And here's the other side of the inverter. Look at that. That's bad. So I bought three more of these off of eBay for whopping holy cow. Um, Ten bucks for three little capacitors. So I'm going to remove the board. Let's put in two new capacitors. And fire the setup and see what happens. Alright, be back. Okay, I uh, pulled out the power board, got the two capacitors replaced, threw it back in, and we're ready for a power test. So, plug the set in, unswitched, alright, groovy, Vizio, lights up. Does it turn on automatically or not? I say not. Uh, which one was the power button? Top one. Okay. Top one. Ooh, Physio went white. Whoo! All right. There's another successful fixed TV, except this one kicks ass, man. 240 hertz, uh, 1080p. Uh, it's just a premium set. So I'm happy 10 bucks fix this set up. $10. All right. Thumbs up down below. Subscribe. Hit that little bell icon down there. Uh, share and like with your friends on Facebook. You know, hey, more people who know about this, more people can fix their own sets for p pennies on the dollar, man. Pennies. Like I said, 10 bucks worth of parts. I got a couple hundred dollar set. M minimum couple hundred dollar set. At least it used to be uh, 10 years ago, but it's still, it's a pretty nice set. So, all right. Any comments uh, down below? Maybe I can answer some questions. Um, all right. Thank you.